Hello, this and that. <laughs> I always use that. I know you rarely use that. Actually, I use this, this one. Hello, guys, and welcome to Gran Turismo Sport and Happy New Year for all of you. All of you. I'm looking forward to another one, another video for this year. Well, n new game as well. Hell, <laughs> yeah. Well, three of them, to be honest. So we on GT Sport. It's not GT Sport, sorry. GT7. We. No, I, I know we got to do the five lead to shoot. Shoot out, but not nah, that was spoiler. I got to do that later. So we got to drive a car, which is literally almost one to get. Well, uh, I want it for a long time. Well, one of them, naturally, he is the car I want, as you know. So this car, I I want to review who personally, but this particular one in the game, this is not. He, he what's a call oh, beep he comment there's a viewer there's, there's re a recommendation but this one this is one I want to do somehow the Mercedes-Benz CLK LM this is the one the AMG division built for the racing for the 24 hour level on race car is that uh, as well and one thing is the cool the coolest one as you know CLK GTR also so built for the FIA GT1 race, a race car. It also have a street version on, the, and this one, one is a LM version, the CLK LM. It's got five liter V8, five liter normally aspirated V8 engine, 600 horsepower. Well, 600 horsepower that time is so on the highest number of all time. 539 newton meters of torque. That's a he good. Uh, that's a very good torque. A lot of torque as well, and also have and only weigh 939 kilos. The reason it also is so light because it's made from carbon fiber, as well. And also this the normal CLK you, you may know it has a front engine rear wheel drive, but this one mid engine rear wheel drive. Right, the CLK LM is one of the most attractive race car used by Mercedes Benz. Yeah, Mercedes Benz built a completed view years as late in 1990s F racing in GT1, which is in touring, in touring car competition, GT1 regulation requires an automaker built in one street car to approve the competition. That's why the Mercedes CLK GTR was on with the 6 liter, say 6.9 it's a V12. But the, the GTR version is a race car on. It was a 6 liter engine. And despite the despite the appearance, these these street cars which have full on race car machine in the CLK. Uh, LA and predecessor CLK GTO or uh, uh, was produced according uh, as the regulation 1997. The FIA GT World Championship began the same year that the CLK GTR took home on the title. Yeah, the, the CLK GTR is very successful as well, but this particular one is very quite successful. Well, CLK LA and was a further evolution of the CLK GTR uh, replaced. Of the V12 engine, which is a six liter, you know, it, it, with the V8 to improve the race car the overall balance, and the, as as soon as as, as soon as uh, it took uh, to the track in, in the 1998 FIA GT the championship, the absolutely dominant in the, in in that year, it took home both drivers and the championship. And one thing is, it cost uh, quite a lot. Six and a half million, and also this car on the Group Two class. And one thing is, I the one honest opinion is, I want it, I want it somehow. Yeah, I want it somehow because I want to drive this thing. I know that the, this car came on in the Grand Turismo Four already, but, but, but you know, this could a car. I want to drive. Yeah, I want to drive it. I need somehow. So that's it. So the one right I want to do is you may know the car uh, make it for yeah the before the racing on the once get of all time the twenty four hour of Le Mans on yeah the twenty four hour of Le Mans race uh, you know that thing right <laughs> yeah that track the most dominant in track even the twenty four hours of Le Mans every year they. He took on June. They held on June, I believe. 
So let's get started anyway.
Although the CLK GTR became a poster, a poster on the a boys' bedroom. Well, all, all the all, all boys' bedroom. This particular car, it's one of the a race car from 90s, late 90s, I should say. This particular CLK LM, well, well, it was. This car is pretty much powerful as well. If you you remember the this thing, yeah, okay. The, they have a Bridgestone tires, and that's why they had a Bridgestone Potenza the tires on this thing as well. So if you remember the GTR GT1 and race car, you may know all the Mercedes, not just Mercedes CLK GTR, not just this one, the CLK LM. So well. they also have the on the GT1 regulation race car is a McLaren F1, Lotus Esprit, uh, uh, Lister Store. Oh, Lister Storm and, and many more on oh, budget F yeah, GT1 race car. You may you know the CLK is dominating the F FIA GT World Championship as well. Oh yeah, if you want to watch the CLK GTI video, you may you gotta watch the the, the racing job okay, channel. The car topic if the car topic is playing. I recommend it watch it. You click the on the I in the banner on the I button here. Uh, if you want to watch, so this LM version is 5 lead. Oh, yeah, if you don't know, this one is already 5 lead, has a 5 lead to engine. It's it's 600 horsepower, but sounds pretty brutal. 6 speed gearbox, 315 kilometers an hour top speed. You know, this thing I dropped it, and there's a raise you, so you may know about this. This particular one, it's very fast, and so it sounds very it sounds nice and revs up to 9000 rpm <laughs> yeah this it can rev 9000 rpm uh, oh yeah uh, you, this the sequential gearbox it uh, this car has a sequential gearbox and the pad pedal shift is the back of the steering wheel you may you may notice it <laughs> so this particular oh yeah you, you, I know, you may notice this is carb full carbon fiber that's what I uh, this oh this car is 900 kilograms yeah AP Racing brakes as well. That's that's pretty cool details as well. Well, so thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to smash a like, subscribe if you are new, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and also and also hold your lap. The link in the description box below. See you guys soon. Assalamualaikum and goodbye.